fourth data management tool is data validation. To do our data validation, I will revert from the filter tool to have full view of my data. And in this case, data validation helps you, the user, to ensure that entries made into your worksheet are correct without errors. What kind of errors can be entered in a worksheet? For instance, in the cells where we need scores, erroneously we can enter letters. Or in other words, we can even have scores that are not valid. For instance, the maximum score for any student in a particular subject is 100. When a score above 100 is entered in a cell, it should be rejected. To help our spreadsheet do that, we will highlight the cells to contain our scores. We will come to the Data tab and click on Data Validation. A dialog box for Data Validation appears where we have three tabs, Settings, Input Message, and error alert. In the settings tab, we set the criteria or the condition. Here, we would like to set our values to only accept from 0 to 100. In the allow drop down menu, we will choose whole number. In the data menu, we will choose between. Our minimum is 0 and our maximum is 100. We move on to the next tab, that is the input message. This will be displayed whenever the validated cell is clicked. The message will have a title, for instance, valid entry and the message will contain what we expect from the user as input for instance we can say please enter a score between 0 and 100 we move to the last tab that is the error alert. This is a message that will be displayed when an erroneous entry that does not conform to our criteria is entered in a validated cell. It will have a title, for instance, error, wrong entry. In the message, we can give the user a description of the error or we can still emphasize what is required from the user. For instance, you can say the entry is invalid. Please enter a score between zero and 100. Once we do those three, we click OK. Notice that once we click in any of the cells we had highlighted for validation, then the input message is displayed. Valid entry is the title. Please enter a score between 0 and 100 is the message. If we try to enter 200 as a score, then the spreadsheet will display to us the error message with the title error wrong entry and the message the entry is invalid. Please enter a score between 0 and 100. Once we click retry, then we can repeat our entry, but this time having the valid data entered.